Welcome back to Zexpress. Today we're going to be bringing some handy tips and tricks for using Google Sites in the 2024, especially if you're getting started. Google Sites is a powerful and free tool from Google that allows you to create websites quickly and easy. Let's explore some beginner-friendly tips to make your Google Sites experience smoother and more productive. Let's dive in. Starting with a clear structure. Tip number one is to start with a clear structure. Before you begin adding content, plan out the structure of your site. Think about the pages you needed and how they should be organized. Think about the pages you needed and how to be, uh, let's say, added into your website. For example, if you go directly into Google Sites, you can see into the left how you have the pages, you have the home. But let's say, for example, that I'm willing to add information I wanted to go about videos, so go for videos only. Then later on, it doesn't matter if this is an actual blank page. You can organize them later. Uh, you can start to fill them up later on. First of all, what I to do is to organize them. So I have the uh, videos. Then I have the blocks. Later, I have the contact us. And lastly, let's say that I wanted to go for our Shopify stores, for example. So this is a website about ourselves and we have already added here to the upper side home. We have videos, blogs, conduct us about the Shopify store. And then later on, you can move on into the next step, which is utilizing the templates. Now, uh, tip number two, don't forget guys to use explore the Google site templates. The templates are pre-made designs that can be great starting points, especially if you use it about the layout or design expert. Go into the template gallery and check out the gallery section that appears in here. You can see that there's a lot of templates. There's not so much, but there's a lot of elements that you can use. And the best part is it's totally for free. You can choose a template that closely matches your vision and customize it to your needs. Which is moving on into the third step customizing your design tip number three guys is to customize your design google sites offer customization option like changing colors funds inserting images to make your site visually appealing uh remember a visual appealing site can make first impression and keep visitors engaged and if you're working with some templates it's going to be much more faster to customize your stuff so remember that if you think that all the elements that are into this template are let's say accurate for what you're actually looking for then later on to changing all the elements should be actually really 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 easy and lastly optimizing for mobile another important tip is to ensure that your site is mobile friendly so if you go into the upper side you want to go directly into this section that says phone so you can check out how it's going to be looking into your phone with more people accessing website via um, smartphones google sites allows you to preview and optimize your site for mobile services this ensures that your site looks great and functions well no matter the device and i can show you guys that eight out of ten people who enter your google sites are going to be from the mobile so you wanted to focus a lot inside the mobile device supporting section guys so there you have it guys some essential tips and tricks for beginners using google sites into the 2023 what i love to use a lot into the google sites is the google integration for example, there's Google Charts, there's Google Forms, there's Google Talk, there's Google Slides, Doc, Map, Calendar, even YouTube videos you can just drag and drop inside your uh, elements of Google Site. All of those elements are actually connected and of course totally for free. If you don't know how to publish, how to create your own custom domain, we're going to leave you guys a link down below in the description so you can get started for free too early today and you can have your own custom today uh, domain instead of the sites.google.com site which is of course totally for free guys so if you find these tips helpful please give us a thumbs up subscribe to expert for more useful guides have any questions on your own tips for google sites you can share them into the comments below thank you so much for watching the video guys happy site building stay tuned for more tech tips and tutorials hopefully we can all see you next time